Hi everybody! The four leading wheel, eight driving wheel, and four trailing wheel arrangement is rightfully considered one of the best. This arrangement was invented on one of my favorite railways, the Northern Pacific. It was the 1920s and the Northern Pacific needed bigger passenger locomotives. So they went to have their motive power department and ALCO team up to build one. It was designated Class A and was their first 484. The wheel arrangement was named Northern. The 12 locomotives were delivered in 1926 numbered 2600 to 2611. The class proved very successful and powerful. In 1930, the Timken roller bearing demonstrator locomotive broke down and was bought by a Northern Pacific. It became the only A1 number 2626. It served on the North Coast Limited between Yakima and Seattle and then from Seattle to Montana. It helped convince Northern Pacific to put more roller bearings into their rolling stock. Baldwin was tasked with building the next locomotive, the A-Class, to be known as the A-2. Ten were delivered from 1934 to 1935. They were numbered 2650 to 2659. They weighed 60,000 pounds more than the A's and proved very powerful walking through heavy grades in the western part of the system. Based on the success of the A2, NP decided to build a near-identical A3. They had more tubes in the boiler and bigger flues, but that was it. They weighed only 2,400 pounds more, and they were delivered by Baldwin in 1938. The eight locos were numbered 2660 to 2677. Three were also delivered to their subsidiary, Spokane, Portland, and Seattle. They must have really liked the basic design of the A2, so they ordered from Baldwin more near-identical engines, the A4s. They were delivered in 1941, number 2670 to 2677. Vestible cabs were added to provide more protection against northern winters. Finally, we have something that is not near-identical to the A2. The A5s were delivered from Baldwin in 1943. They were still very similar to the A2s, weighing 15,000 pounds more. That lighter steel was going to more important things in the war effort was a part. Ten were delivered number 2680 to number 2689. They ran 999 miles without engine change, a record for a coal-burning steam locomotive. They also had very big tenders, comparable to the size of the Z-Class articulateds. Due to dieselization, they were retired starting with the A-Class in 1949. Most of the classes have finished retiring by 1958. The last A-5s were retired in 1959 and none of them were preserved. I personally really love the A-Classes. I think they're very good looking locomotives. They're also very well designed and powerful locomotives and it's a shame that none of them were preserved. Please like and subscribe.